Hey guys, it's Wes. Um, sorry I hadn't had a video up in a while, but I guess now it's DVD update time. I've, I've been working a lot lately and uh, I'm kind of tired today, but I'm going to go ahead and uh, show you some DVDs I've gotten recently. First, I want to talk about um, a transaction mix-up online, um, which kind of is frustrating. Um, finally got it worked out, but I just watched a video today from, I believe his name is Eight, the chosen one. The dude's got some awesome videos. He's like really animated and funny, and uh, you know, really uh, enjoyable to watch his videos. But he was, uh, I think he had one like rant video where he was talking about how he was, you know, ticked off at all these online people that were that were false advertising and and you know, sending the wrong stuff. And he was showing how stuff was damaged and all kind of crap, you know. And that that is really frustrating. And I had something kind of similar happen to me here recently. Um. I wanted to order the the special uh, box set, the uh, Saw trilogy, that has the cool uh, puppet mask packaging and everything, um, and that's the way it was advertised on the on the site. And actually, I got it from Amazon Marketplace, um, but that's how they described it. And I think it was like 16 or 17 bucks, and I'm like, yeah, you know, that's a pretty good price. So um, anyway, I went ahead and got that, and I waited on it and waited on it. And when I finally got it, this is the crap they sent me. And I haven't even opened it yet, but they sent me this, uh, this is all three Saw movies, but it's this crappy, like, Walmart version. It has all three films in 4x3 full screen, as you can see here. Um, it's not the packaging that, that they talked about, and it's not the same set, period. I mean, it's a completely different thing. So I emailed them back, and, you know, I thought for a while I was just kind of out. You know, I didn't, you know, I wasn't going to get my money back or anything. But fortunately, they came through and did give me my money back. Now, I haven't mailed this back yet. I probably should uh, send it back. I don't know. I mean, they, they really screwed me over here. But um, I haven't opened it yet. So I guess if, I guess the right thing to do would be just to mail it back to them now that I have, that they refunded my money. I don't know. What do you guys think? Um, but this is obviously was false advertising. So I got this, I was kind of ticked because this is definitely not not what I ordered. Um, however, I got my money back from that and I went through another vendor and I finally got the thing that I really wanted, which was this. And this is the Saw Trilogy box set that I wanted with this cool puppet packaging and, and everything. This is like actually has um, six discs in it. It has over 15 hours of special features. You know, the commentaries, I mean, each movie has two discs. Um, some of you have this. Um, I've, I've seen it, and, um, you know, I realize there's five saws. I do have part five. I don't have part four, actually. But I think the first three are probably um, probably the best ones. Uh, and as I thought, five wasn't too bad. But, uh, but this has the first three films. Um, it's pretty neat packaging. Let me see if I can show you this without cutting the fool out of myself. This stuff is really sharp, this plastic. Uh, that this is packaged in, so you got to be careful. It's about like opening one of those, uh, I don't know, a pack of scissors or something that you buy at the store, or some kind of, you know, something with that plastic, sharp plastic packaging. You got to be careful you don't. Ah, man. But this, uh, this slides out of here. Let me see if I can get this here. And it's, you can see, it's kind of like a three-dimensional puppet mask uh, slipcase basically um, has the same thing on the back here as on the uh, the outer case talks about the different features and you know and then this is kind of like plastic kind of feeling uh, puppet it's face this is pretty cool this slides off and you have your uh, you know your regular case here and then this opens up, and you have inside you have um, two discs for each movie. This is the uncut edition, widescreen version. Has the special features on disc two, filmed there. You flip this, and you have um, there's Saw two feature film, and then you have your special features on that disc as well. And then Saw three director's cut 
disc one and your special features on disc two. So that's a pretty cool set there. I haven't checked it out yet, but it's supposed to have a lot of features and uh, you know it's obviously a widescreen format like I wanted it in the first place. So thank goodness I finally got that. I did have to pay a little bit more for it, but sometimes I guess it's too good to be true if something seems really cheap and you know uh, like uh, like Mr. Uh, Eight said. <laughs> Uh, if it doesn't have a, a you know actual picture, I mean you know a real picture, if it's like a stock photo or anything else like that, you probably shouldn't trust it because you just never know. But um, but that's the whole kind of saw debacle. Like I said, I got that worked out finally. So so yeah, I got my money back and I got um, I'm stuck with the you know the original one that they sent me. So I guess probably the right thing to do is just be sending it back to them. Because, like I say, I haven't opened it. I mean, I wasn't even going to open it. I mean, heck, I don't want the full screen versions of Saul, you know, of, of these three films. I mean, that's not what I ordered. So, it's kind of irritating when people false advertise. And, and uh, you know, and the company did apologize and say that they had some new employees that were mixing up orders or something like that. You know, maybe they do. I mean, I guess I can cut them somewhat of a break. But, um, still kind of frustrating when that happens. So, I mean, I guess you take a risk anytime you order stuff online. But most of the time, everything I've ordered has been fine. But glad to finally get the the one that I really wanted. Um, I think these Saw films are great. They're uh, just very different, very different type of horror and uh, sort of mystery and uh, all that. You know, kind of rolled in. It's like a crime drama and a horror movie and a slasher movie and and just a lot of suspense and all just all rolled into one as, as you all know that have seen them and I guess each time you just want to tune in to see what the new kills are going to be like because they're all just really bizarre I mean and some of these contraptions they use are just insane but that's the Saw thing let me go through quickly uh, some of these movies I picked up today I went to Walmart and uh, as you all know they got some good deals like five dollar movies and stuff so these are some films that I really like that I didn't have in my collection that I just went ahead and picked up. So we got Stand By Me, the special edition. This is a great movie. Um, these are not horror, the ones that are, well, actually one of them is kind of some suspense. But uh, but anyway, this is Stand By Me, um, the special edition, widescreen, has some special features, uh, digitally mastered audio, video, um, has a featurette has Rob Reiner's commentary, um, it has some trailers and things like that, isolated music score, so this is a great movie uh, based on a short story called The Body by Stephen King, and this obviously has a young River Phoenix, Corey Feldman, Jerry O'Connell, Kiefer Sutherland, Will Wheaton, I mean it's just a great movie, um, so I'm sure most of you have seen it, but that's Stand By Me. Picked up Liar Liar, Jim Carrey, Collector's Edition, five bucks, this is a funny movie. I used to have this on VHS, but um, I didn't have it on DVD, so I wanted to pick this up. Um, widescreen has a uh, commentary and uh, some outtakes and things like that, so this should be fun to, to check out again. So, liar, liar. I got this. This is great. Um, I saw Cool Duder show this one time in his update, and this is this is the edition to have. Apparently, uh, there there may be a better edition out there, but I like this one. This is a uh, Who Framed Roger Rabbit, of course, classic um, animation mixed with live action um, movie directed by um, Robert Zemeckis, I believe. Yeah, and as Bob Hoskins, and uh, it's just a great great film. This is the Vista series. Um, which is really neat. It's got this cool slip case. It's got lots of features. It opens up. It kind of looks like a, a leather bound uh, attache case or something here. I don't know. And then that opens up. It's basically a digipack and you have your some good artwork. You have your two discs here. Bonus features and movie. And it has these two little like art cards. Jessica Rabbit with a, a signature there and Roger Rabbit with a signature. So it's pretty neat. It's got, you know, apparently it's got a lot of extra fe special features too um, on it. So, which let me see if I can, if you can really see all those. But it has widescreen and full screen uh, formats. It has a bunch of behind the scenes, uh, different animation tests and things like that. And looking forward to checking this out. This has a lot of stuff. This is apparently, like I say, a great addition. And so far it looks like it's really nice. So, it's great to have that. I did. This was about thirteen dollars at Walmart, so not not too bad of a price either. And I'm gonna take. A, I'm about to run out of time here, so I'm gonna. I'll be right back. <laughs> 